In this video, I will be addressing the issue of whether it's possible to download your presentation from Tom AI or not. And also, um, there have been new features introduced on Tom that I would want to share with you. Let's take this journey together. Hello guys, welcome to my channel. My name is Nasif, and I make tech tutorial videos to help you increase your productivity and efficiency at whatever you do. If you are interested in my videos, kindly subscribe, like, click the notification button in order to get notified whenever I post a new video. And also comment in the comment box below the softwares you would want me to make tutorials on. Now let's move to the focus of this video. Unfortunately, as at the time of making this video, you would not be able to download templates from Tomb AI or your presentation from Tomb AI. However, it is possible to present your presentation offline. This means you can slide through all your slides or play all your slides offline. That's a bad news, um, but we are hoping that in the final version, there would be um, a download button for us to download um, the templates or the presentation that we make. Um, however, I also see that the final version could come with a subscription service. Um, so let's just watch out. Let's move to our next focus which is the updates that has been made on Tomb. Within the last three weeks since my first video on Tomb was created, um, there has been a lot of updates, uh, amazing updates that has been uh, added to Tomb, which I would want to explore with you. Let's move to my screen and let me show you some of the updates. Hello, welcome to my screen. And today it's all about the updates from Tomb. Okay, so first of all, I received an email from Tom that says the next chapter of AI, that is storytelling. So the next chapter of Tom is all about uh, storytelling, how to structure your presentation to look more like you are telling a story. So that is all about the new development of AI. So this is able to help you restructure your presentation to be very persuasive, um, playful, objective, um, formal and informal, inspirational, like everything. It's just like um, having keyboards. So the same, the same way. I think that is the same idea that they are bringing on board. So yeah, so let's just dive in into Tom. Yeah, so that is the Tom. So beginning in my previous video, if you want to know how to sign in, watch my previous video in the description below. Okay, now um, Tom has been launched and um, let's see what, what's new. Um, I still have 434 credits. So I still have more credit to to go with. So I'll just create a new um, a new template. So what's uh, what's new on Tom? Um, this button initially was not around. So now we have a presentation. You just make the presentation and um, only outline. Present you with only outline and then um, story. Present you with a storytelling or a compelling story for your presentation. So I'll just try to use them one after the other for you to see the difference. So um, software evolution, and then I'll center my focus on um, the picture that I want to use, the image I want to use. I'll just say cyberpunk. So let me just use that one and then let's go. So um, what it's doing is that yeah, generating the presentation so I, ha I have um, five pages now. Eight, yes. So I have eight pages now. Comparing this to my previous um, video, you can see that this this brings out a lot of um, information that is below paragraph with a lot of information. So that is one improvement from um, Tom. And this is very amazing. So rise of software, benefits of software. If you go through it, it's the story is very compelling and very um, natural. Yes. So that is yeah. So that is it. So 
I will try to um, save this, but I'll create another one for you to have a look at. Um, so let me, it's already saved, it's on notice save. So let me just go back and then I would um, recreate another one with the same topic that is software revolution. So software revolution, but I'll change it to uh, presentation outline and then maybe epic pictures will be good then enter okay great so if you don't want this you can try it again and then it will generate a different for you so let's go through this software evolution a new dawn so this is one of um, the outline uh, presentation created that is yeah and then the next one is software. So if this introduction to software revolution, so this created um, subtopics. So it has subtopics that you want to cover. So that is that is the presentation. So yes, so some people pre present their work by uh, using subtopics. Some also present their work by using detail uh, details below it. So whichever you want yes so this seems more like a professional way of presenting your work yes that is great so let's go to the next one that is um another one for us to use a story yes so i'll select the story and then maybe let me see auto let me just put it on auto and then generate for me okay so software revolution okay so i have nine pages if i don't want i'll just retry it again and then it will create a different thing for me so initially i had a six page uh, presentation presentation and the next one i had a eight page and now i'm having another nine i think it's it's eight yes eight so it's eight pages so but with different images that is done of uh, a revolution so the topic it gave us was still um, software revolution the next one is um, the outline of topics and then the dawn of a revolution and then a new way of life so um, the impact of a revolution, uh, the future of software, uh, the power of automation, and then the end of an era. So this is a story that if you read, like it's it makes more meaning. I will try to um, post it on YouTube for you to have a read of it and then actually compare the difference. This is really very great and then I think this is a great improvement on Toom and um, I think this is uh, the change we want in presentation. That is great. So you can still do whatever you want. Um, you can play around with the templates um the teams the colors you can do everything with it if you don't know how to use it just go to my previous video at the the link uh, below in the description and then you have a look at it and then you'll be able to do it do the adjustment in your template also there has been an introduction of a new tab that is tome for education so if you are an educational institution who wants to leverage on uh, the power of AI t for your presentation or to assist your students work efficiently you can go for the tomb for AI and then I think when you register with the um, your domain that ends with dot edu you would have I think you unlock 5,000 AI credits for your school which is worth over hundred hundred dollars and like this is amazing it's amazing so yeah you can jump onto it and then use it for your research assist student presenting works and yeah 